Okay, um, I'm gonna go into this with a good demeanor or with a good mindset because what I just read here could be very, very, um, bad. <laughs> okay, so the new hero is Camila and Matrana. So I gave up knowing where Gloxenia is. I gave up with him. Like, Gloxenia is JP exclusive. It's whatever at this point. But here's what intrigues me. So, we're getting car we're getting Camila and Matrona, and here's the thing. Matrona was a unit that released, like, before Guy's Elizabeth. And right here, if we can skip this for a minute, um, it says Leonis Festival check-in event, or basically... This is the the festival eve. Yeah, festival eve. And as we got in August, we got Blue Arthur as the festival e character. So what this is basically telling me is guys Elizabeth is most likely dropping next week. And I am absolutely fuming. I am actually a little bit nervous if she is dropping. Maybe this is just like, oh, Festival Eve, like, you know, we're going to give you like a little bit more time. Or maybe they're just trolling. No, obviously they're not. This is actually insane. Because they don't say Festival Eve. Like, nonchalant. They said this with Blue Arthur, and then the next week, Lost Familial is dropped. So, when they say Festival Eve with this one, that could only mean one thing. Guys, Elizabeth is most likely dropping, and it's absolutely. Oh my goodness. Like, this is actually insane. This is actually bad, too, because I thought she was dropping in December because it made sense because it'll be three months after Lost Vang because on JP, Guys Elizabeth dropped three months after Lost Vang Meliodas. And so to, so to go in this with... Me knowing that she could drop next week is actually terrifying because I spent so many diamonds on the KOF banner. Like, I spent like 390 something diamonds, maybe something like that. So, if we can go to the JP um, side of things here, I am going to go to the past banners. And we are going to look at Guys Elizabeth. Now, actually, um, if I remember, actually, Guys Elizabeth, I think she released in May, if I'm not mistaken here. Yeah, if I remember, I think she released, like, May 28th. Oh, crap, she did release May 28th. Oh. Oh, no, two months then. Oh, gosh, I'm mistaken. <sighs> Please don't tell me they're releasing Guys Elizabeth. That will be insane. Now, for the people that saved up all their diamonds for this woman, props to y'all. But for the people that actually went on the KOF banner and past banners, we're gonna be we're gonna be screwed. Because look, my luck doesn't come in the in like a pixie jar or something like that. Basically, I don't have good luck when it comes to banners. Like Zeldris, I got him on the first draw, but that was nothing. Like ever since then, I've been getting so unlucky with my pulls. Hell, the King of Fighters banner screwed me over. I got Rugal's second multi, and then I got my after like three hundred more diamonds. Like. So, I'm going to get into the maintenance, though. I'm sorry for rambling here. So, here's the thing. 
Um, you can also get these guys right here, Blue Demon Meliodas, um, Blue Blue Lilia and Valenti. When you reach the loyalty go, um, to select one of them, which honestly, I it's whatever because I mean. Like as I already said so many times in the past, I don't care about Pierce. I like Lilia, but it's not like I'm going to pair her up with Blue Demon Meliodas. So Valenti is like the only character I really care about, especially since I don't have her yet. And here's the great thing. You can actually get a bunch of tickets with this event. You can get up to 154 draws, so that's awesome. Uh, here's Camila's set, though. Um, Camila do be looking fine, though. Um, man. And Matrona set right there as well. Um, these two, um, Camila's, she's okay. She's not the best, but she can be okay when she goes into transformation mode. And Matrona is pretty garbage. Her, I seen this woman hit up to like 12k. That's pretty sad. Or. She but she doesn't do a lot of damage. She she's like a support unit, I guess, but she does not hit hard at all. And um, yeah, the goodbye King of Fighters event. Um, uh, we're getting more tickets this week, so hopefully you guys can pull more on the on the King of Fighters banner because I sure did not get lucky the first time around. So I'm hoping I can at least get Golter or Keo. I won't care if I get Athena either. I mean, she has a great passive. I could use her in the back. Um, you can get decorations. 10 Western furniture, 10 Seaside furniture, each sell for 30 diamonds. And increased purchase limit at the Nighthood shop. So it went from 10 to 30. And the double event... You can hit up to 60 on these. And these obviously got increased as well. And um, the ending events. Um, Force of Attraction. So Roxy and Shin's banner is leaving. And the um, the Roxy and Shin one with the SSR pendants is leaving as well. So make sure you get those pendants because that's 7 free pendants. Um, I'm hoping to God they don't release... Uh, I know they're going to do it. They literally just said Festival Eve. You don't say Festival Eve nonchalant. Like, you don't say that nonchalant. But that only means one thing. Guys, Elizabeth is hitting next week. And we're just going to have to deal with it. I mean, a lot of people have been quitting at this point. So I won't be mad at you if you decide to quit. I won't even be surprised if you decide to quit. This is just sad. This is honestly insane. Like, it makes sense. I mean, two months, like, in, like, March 26th, Las Vegas Melios dropped. May 28th, God's Elizabeth dropped. So I guess it makes sense from a standpoint. But from a Diamond's point, this is absolutely insane. Like, so unless you just have that God touch luck, you're not going to get God's Elizabeth. If you have like small diamonds, like if you're at like 200 something diamonds, like where I'm at right now, it's just, it's not going to be good for you. And I'm not going to purchase like hundreds of dollars of diamonds, like hundreds of dollars worth of diamonds just for this festival unit. Well, that's the maintenance. Um, Camila and Matrona, cool. Glossinia, JP exclusive, that's basically what they're saying. Pierce, who cares? Valenti, eh. Cool, if you don't have these guys yet. Guys, Elizabeth may be hitting next week. Terrifying. So that's basically everything in a nutshell. So, uh, that's a... Oh boy, what is Neff Marble doing? <sighs>